I'm thinking about um, practicing or <clears throat> in some ways nowadays I think it's more like keeping yourself, keeping your chops working, keeping everything going, which obviously like a lot of people we, we, we work in blocks and then you may be very inactive, you know, gig wise for could be a long period of time. So what do you how do you keep yourself in shape, how do you play? Um, people that have influenced me with that when I look back are again people like Cam Wheeler who religiously practices every day, does them to keep he's a trumpet player so he has to. But it's the same for maybe for a saxophone player, you have to keep things working. Um, I'm not a natural practicer. I don't have this urge to play for 25 hours a day, which I know some people do. I mean, obviously, can... I did when I was young. I worked very, very hard and practiced in um, maybe a little disorganized way. I, did, I couldn't find it wasn't the jazz education wasn't isn't what it was now. You know, I didn't. I wasn't. I wasn't a transcriber. Which, if I had my time again and I went back, I would probably. I would do. But it wasn't something that I did when I sat down. Um, I'm con concerned about sound. That's a big issue for me. Um, I try not to waste time fiddling around with mouthpieces and reeds and that kind of stuff. But just think about creating a sound, which is created in your. For me, it's in, it's in your mind. It's in your head. And, but mainly, what I do, and the, it's the pressure of time. Most, most of us, the real world, and so on, I have a family, and I'm busy. And I'm teaching, and I'm writing, and I write for big bands. And, there are only so many things you can do in a day, but I, I just like to play, I actually practice playing tunes. And I don't mean just a tune, but obviously playing a tune and then soloing, but with everything, harmony, time, meter, I try to practice things. now playing things in, which has become a kind of common thing, you know, playing a tune instead of in four, you might play a standard in five or seven or something. And um, I just try and play, so I'm performing. And I suppose what I'm kind of thinking is like, uh, actually performing, even if it's just in your little practice room on your own, so you're always performing, because that's the hard thing, it's one thing to practice, another thing is when you walk out on that stage and everything is different, that's the hard, that's a very, um, it's a very big difference. Mm -hmm.